Small. What's up, Rick? Yo, I gotta give you your flowers, boy. You hear me? Appreciate it, dog. Let me watch the screen. Appreciate it, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't think you was gonna be uh from Lady. I ain't gonna lie to you. Ain't nobody did, my boy. <laughs> you wasn't playing. And you know what's crazy about it? You said for a hundred K, I'ma find a way to be Rum Nitty. You said that. Yeah, straight up though. Honey K, boy. I'm so close. <laughs> so let me ask you a question. That all right, boom. Cause it seemed like Rum Nitty was the favorite to win the tournament. Now that you got past him, do you say are you looking at it like yo, that's my shit? That's my hundred K now. Um now, I, I mean, to be honest with you, I'm just taking that shit one battle at a time. Cause like, uh, okay. Vaughn's still a dangerous motherfucker, man. And like, you know, like, I, like I give Nitty and, and Ab and all them boys they props. But like, you know, everybody looking at Vaughn's right now for the punching. You know, Nitty already been labeled to go to that shit. But like, you know, under under that, Vaughn's is really like that punching nigga right now. Okay, so, so. I mean, punches. You don't. You don't just punch, but you have real talk in all reality. So I don't really think you. You. You don't focus on punches. You don't really care about that. So you feel like your style can be any punch style. I mean, you just beat Rum Nitty, my nigga. Yeah, I. I do though. I just like. I always want to be one of them niggas that that showed like, I can do what the fuck I want and still pull off a victory. Don't ever tell me what I gotta do. What I got to do to win a battle. You know what I'm saying? Like I just always feel like. I'm here for a reason, and the reason that I'm not here, not off punching. So why would I have to rely on that now? And then, hold up, because somebody said something in the comments that really threw me off. You messed up in the second round, and you still won. Yeah, that shit crazy. I ain't, I ain't like, like, bro, you was going 30 him. You was, damn, you was going 30 him, bro. Yeah, yeah. People be asking me, am I, was I, did that bother me? Um, the only thing bothering me is like to be honest, I don't know if it was like a overheating or like too amp, but like when I'm stumbling, when I'm stumbling, I'm actually saying what the fuck I'm supposed to be saying in my head. It just ain't coming out, you know what I'm saying? So like it was just more so like cool down, man. You you good, you doing what you need to do, cool down, jump to the next bar, fuck it. Like we ain't taking time on like pondering. That was a bar that 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 I stumbled on. I'm like, all right, this one of them. But then I had to just tell myself in my head, like, bro, all this shit, one of them. Like, nigga, you wild and mm. fuck that. Go to the next. Mm. That's, um, I'm pretty sure that it does. Well, cause you be like, fuck. You be like, you be mad at yourself. We all see it. So we, we know that you're going, you going 110% with this shit. Yeah, that's, but I ain't gonna lie. That's one thing I really want to learn in this shit. Because, like, they, they keep it a thousand. That's why... I be telling people, I really learn shit on the fly, dog. Like, you know, like, the veterans know, like, with Suge, I learned from Suge, because Suge was on some shit, like, yeah, 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 yeah. That's him fucking up, but he know how to keep it going to where, you know, he think on it, T-top, let me get that water. Like, I'm just learning different shit here and there or whatever. So, like, it's just a matter of, like, like, like learning learning them little, the little tricks and trades of battle rap, bro. That's all it is. Okay, but, yo, I'm not, I know one thing, that material was hitting, bro. That material, like, when you started, your, your first round was crazy. Your whole first round was crazy. I was like, oh, what the hell? Like, what the fuck going on with this nigga here? And shit, you not playing. Yeah, yeah, I wasn't, though. I ain't gonna lie. It was just, I know people, what pissed me off so much was, I know what everybody was thinking. I was counted out the minute they knew I had the battle needed. And it was just more so, like, you know, like, people around me, like, bro, you had a good run. I'm like, nah, it ain't over yet. Then, like, you step in the building, everybody just looking at you like, damn, bro, you know, just do your thing, bro. It is what it is. And I'm just like, so I'm in the face all motherfucker, like, hitting me up. Like, bro, you look worried. You scared this, that? I said, no, I'm focused, bro. Like, seriously, bro, it ain't too much to talk about. Like, I'm focused, so people. It, bro. I ain't gonna lie, nigga, focus. And, and it ain't too much to talk about. It ain't too much to damn sit and face off about, bro. Like, I'm not about to tell a nigga what I'm gonna do to you tomorrow. I'm, I'd rather just pull up, like, with it. And, like, this bag that I'm in right now, I just, I really thank God for it. me going through the slumps that I went through and learning how I learned because I, I, no, it ain't no bullshit. I'm a street nigga, bro. I think about the dollars that's in front of me the everyday mm. life shit that I really got to get. So, like, a nigga really was backing away from battle rap 
thanks to the politics, thanks to everything that you got to do to sell a battle, thanks to all the weirdo shit that you got to keep people entertained with. It's just a matter of like, like, fuck it, nigga, you belong here, bro. If you're going to do that shit, go all the way. If you're not, back away from it and, and do what you've been doing. But I'm like, bro, I'm here for a reason. And like this redemption that I'm on, it ain't momentarily. It ain't temporarily like a nigga back for real like type shit. Oh, so you taking this a hundred percent? You was really gonna back away from battle rock? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, cause like to be honest, it's it's a lot that you got to do with it. It's a lot of politics. I, like, I'm not about to argue with niggas for three and four years just to get a battle. I'm not about to do all this weirdo shit on social media and all that shit just to keep some shit going. So like, it's just a matter of it's just a matter of like 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 handling your business. Like I don't know. It's just so much with battle rap. The shit's so weird and like I don't like it. Because, like, a lot of niggas talk crazy, do a lot of weirdo shit to where, like, in these streets, I would have to do something to you about that. And, like, mm. before I get to that point and realize, it's just more so realizing, like, yo, this shit, real fabricated in WWE type shit. So, like, you really got to just be smart and don't trick yourself out of your position type shit. Niggas going to talk. Niggas going to do crazy shit. It just is what it is. It come with the territory. Man, Swamp versus Fonz coming up. Man, you get past Fonz, you you what you in the finals? Yep. You in the goddamn final? A hundred K swamp from yep. South Carolina. That's the thing about it, bro. People don't realize my motivation ain't what you think my motivation is. My motivation is all these people that around me in this country, all the people that that from South Carolina that motherfuckers don't give a chance to, and, and like they never seen shit like this before. And they never seen nobody like be on the platform that I'm on and repping that shit and like. To be honest, when you come from where I'm from, a lot of times you got to twist and turn your shit to adapt to everybody to accept you, and then you can go back to your roots. I, I think I'm one of the niggas that's going to embrace that shit and make you accept that shit regardless. Like, I'm not going to change it or cater it to anybody else except this country as country bunking, <laughs> dirty south shit, because I'm not changing, and you go respect it. Hey, I think I'll be working for the south for real. I ain't mad at that, man. Yeah, I really down and like shout out to Needy, the, one of the realest niggas I know in battle rap, bro. He ain't make no excuses. And then like he just one of them ones where like that nigga can really take a hiatus and like chill the fuck out. But he active, he outside, he ain't running from shit. You can catch Nitty on Summer Madness and Gnome, but you can catch that nigga on Super Fights. You can catch that nigga on Band Legacy. Like he outside, man. Salute to that nigga, a real nigga and. A lot of niggas would have shitted on me in that situation. Like, bro, I got so much going on. I already won the tournament. Like, bro, it ain't that big to me. It is what it is. Yeah, you won by, but like, the nigga really embraced the fact with me and embraced that moment with me. And because, like, you know, that shit really touched me to beat Rum Nitty. And I'm a keep it a thousand. I never seen that happening. I seen me winning the battle if I did what I needed to do. But in that type mm -hmm. of man. I ain't, I ain't seen that shit happening like that, dog. I mean, you were confident, but it's rum. I mean, it's rum nitty, so we can't say, oh, man, it's either walkthrough. You dig what I'm saying? But I definitely I definitely feel where you come from. You had you had to have your confidence, obviously. Yeah, yeah. For all, for, but for all y'all weirdos thinking y'all fit, like, it, it ain't gonna do a nigga no good to come in there and fucking damn talk to me about no page flips. Nitty did it all, bro. It ain't nothing okay. that, like, like, Coming in there with Sean Page flips and Swamp get it out the mud shit. Nitty then then broke the mold with that shit, bro. Try something else. And then when you go to try something else, nine times out of ten, you dead. You're not pulling my card. It ain't no chinks in my armor. It, it ain't no you not a street nigga for real. I pull your resume, blah, blah, blah. You really gotta you really gotta like be yourself and rap with yourself. Cause like me, I'm the battle rap neutralizer, bro. I ain't gonna lie, I'm I'm, I'm understanding that shit. These niggas that got the superpowers, that shit don't work on me. I don't give mm. a fuck about you enough for it to work on me. Mm. So you feel like your, your worst enemy is you, actually. Myself, and, and you bro, do get your shit down ain't no nigga, pat. Ain't no nigga in battle where I ever dog walk me. Ain't no nigga can just say, I beat the fuck out of Swamp. No nigga can mm. say that. It's always battles where they like, damn, Swamp stumble, slip, this, that, the third, blah, 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 blah. And it's just like. I'm tired of that. It ain't that ain't happening no more. And like you know, it happened in the last battle, but that shit ain't even matter. And I, I pat myself on the back because a lot of niggas in that situation would have folded and figured like, damn, it's over. I done slipped, stumbled, now they ain't fucking with me. Judge it. That's a fact.
if you slip and stumble with these judges, they figure in their mind you're not hungry enough for a hundred thousand. People don't mm. realize, like, like, bro, I got two weeks. I only got yeah. two weeks, and this is back to back. Like, you know what I'm saying? I, 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 I fucking battled Dot and jumped straight in the tournament. So I haven't mm. had a rest moment for a month and some change. So it's just two weeks back to back, and like, you gotta have a hundred thousand dollars worth of material every two weeks. When I yeah. get a nigga name. It's it, like I tell, I keep saying this shit, bro. For the first couple of days, you getting all the generic bullshit about your opponent. That you gotta wait till that phase pass through before you start getting that fire shit. People don't realize mm. that fire shit come the week of the battle, days before the battle. Now you figure out how you can change around and put this, take that out, and all that shit. But like, just respect the motherfuckers that's in the tournament, because nine times out of ten, your favorite battle rapper couldn't do this shit, bro. Right? Wow. So, so you find the tournament is underrated in a sense? It is because. This is where niggas is working at. This is where motherfuckers really putting on and showing like, this is what I do. I'm here type shit. I, every two weeks, I'm popping up with fire material and delivering for y'all. You don't got to wait six months to eight months to a year or see me once a year type shit. You see me every two weeks. Let me ask you a question, B. After this tournament is done, where do you see yourself? And what I mean by that is, Obviously, you're still gonna be battle rapping, but is there a certain a certain level you want to be on? Certain names you just want to battle. I mean, like, uh, you know, how they always ask you, "Where do you see yourself in five years?" Something like that is what I'm asking. You. I mean, like, with me, you know, like I know how temporary battle rap is and how short lived it is, and like the attention span of battle rap is so small. Like, anything could happen, and they go forget about Swamp beating Nitty. You know what I'm saying? It's mm. just like, uh, 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 so like me get my own personal goals and shit out of the way and beating Nitty was one of them, but you know, it's time for motherfuckers to stop playing with me. Like, the the, the fucking weird-ass cornballs, like Sue surfing them, like, like, like stop playing with me. Those are weirdos. Super, like, like, I get it. Niggas like surf, they, they, they don't like when you don't care about them. They don't like mm. when, 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 when you ain't in a rush to be a groupie for them and shit like that. When you don't care that they in the same building that you own. Because, like, niggas like surf, you got to shut the fuck up by now because I went from you don't know a nigga named Swamp. Then I went to Swamp as a Pokemon. Then I went to Swamp and never be on the same card as me, Civil War. Then I went to like Swamp ain't this. He don't deserve that. And like, I'm just tired of it in a sense, but I'm going to let my work prove myself. Me arguing and bickering yeah. back and forth with these niggas, I ain't with all that shit. Because like, truth be told, a lot of these niggas ain't shit without Battle Rap. And they weirdos. That's why they. That's why everything revolves around fucking battle rap. That's why you're on spaces for eight to twelve hours, like you pulling a work shift. That's why, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just being real. I get tired of the shit because if every time you mention to me you shitting on my name, man, fuck you. To be real, it ain't like that in the flesh. I'm gonna be real. It don't be like that. There ain't no pressure from these niggas. And like niggas know how I rock because nine times out of ten, when I'm in Cali and all of these places, I'm dolo. And, 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 and like I, I hold the same energy. I hold the same respect too. At the same time, okay. I respect everything around me. But at the same time, when you disrespect, I'm diving about that. I'm like, it, it is what it is. I'm just tired of these motherfuckers shitting on me. I salute motherfuckers like Tay Rock because a nigga like Tay Rock gonna say, "All right, bitch, you cut up like that again. I'm gonna kick your ass." Instead of just shitting on a nigga, you know what I'm saying? Like salute the Tay Rock and the motherfuckers that damn, you know give a nigga his flowers, but at the same time pop their shit instead of just shitting on the nigga. Like, I ain't got time for the weirdo like surfing shit, motherfuckers that. I don't care about your third round with Hitman. I don't care about your music catalog. I don't care how many records you sold. I don't care about your, your fucking hoodies that you selling in the summertime that nobody can't wear right now. I don't care about that shit. <laughs> fuck you. To be real, fuck you. So, so down the line, do you want to battle surfing the line? Yes, I do. I do. But like, the with a nigga like that, they're going to ask for a million dollars and Jesus and 12 yeah. disciples to host the battle. Like, they're going to ask for some bullshit, but it's all good. Come outside or shut the fuck up. You won't get entertained oh, wow. by me no more. Like, I'm not entertaining them weirdo. Oh, wow. He ain't okay. beating, he ain't beating it in that matter. I don't give a fuck. Damn, okay. Okay, talk your shit, Swamp. I ain't mad at that, bro. You tired of niggas playing with your name, basically. Yeah, because, like, people... People be wanting you to care too much. Like, I don't care how much money a nigga got. What you eat don't make me shit. And then, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't care. I'm straight where I'm at. I'm good. I'm not hurting for nothing. I'm well off. I'm blessed. 
Like, so like when niggas get to saying, you ain't this, you ain't got no Johnny Dang chain, you ain't got this, that, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> you yeah. want to rap or not? Nah, like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. How you feel about the spaces? You said you said he'd be on for like eight to 12 uh, hours a day, but how do you feel about the spaces in general? Because everybody be on, it seemed like, for like 15, 16 hours. It's looking crazy. Yeah, the, the, the spaces, I think they, they doing what battle rap normally does, run shit in the ground, bro. And it's just a matter of like, because like spaces is a place where you can really get to sit there and listen to your favorite battle rapper talk and feel mm-hmm. like you in tune with them because they may pull you up the way you can say something or they may let you voice your opinion and become a speaker and all of that shit. And you feel like, oh shit, they fuck with me. Not knowing that the nigga just using you right now. Mm-hmm. So like, it's just a matter of the spaces. Like they done fucked it up. I salute the spaces because some people battling their own spaces. Some people damn networking and shit on spaces. But I won't get wrapped up in that shit because like, it's, it's all fabricated, and then at the end of the day, it's so time-consuming that you forget about everyday life. Motherfuckers really in there falling asleep on the phone like they talking to a bitch or something. Like, come on, man, you waking up and going to sleep to surf? Like, what the fuck? Yeah. Yo, this nigga swamp, I, Yo, I don't know, man. The, 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 the spaces came out of nowhere and shit. I didn't realize how long people were actually on the spaces, though. You know what I'm saying? Until people started saying it, they they on for like fucking eight hours, thirteen hours. I'm just like, yo, how is niggas even? I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Yeah, I don't know, man. That shit just down. I just don't want to get caught up in the shit. And like, my problem was, I got too caught up arguing with niggas trying to prove like I'm really supposed to be here. I'm that nigga too, and blah blah blah. Without the resume behind it, without the work, and I only been here this long, and blah, blah. Cause like I'm so sick of niggas. Where was you, Summer Madness one? And where was you when we was outside on 54th and Lennox? Bitch, I wasn't there, but then, but I'm here now. So like, don't talk about that with me, man. I don't care what you was doing then. I did enough to be in the same mentions as you now. So true. Oh yeah, you know what? That's true. That's true. Everything that you did the past 20 years led you up to having conversations with me. Mm. So like. Well, so you not you not you not really impressed. You just ready for war with niggas and shit to show niggas what yeah, you got. Man, if you go talk your shit, be prepared to go to war. Don't just be talking shit just to troll, man. Like you won't smoke or not. Like, I ain't all that arguing for 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 years and shit. And that's another thing. Now with my career, I don't want to lose sight of shit, bro. I don't want no more T top waiting for thirty years. I don't want no more twerk run around shit. Like, bro. I want to battle, he want to battle, lock it in, bro. The same way y'all do these other motherfuckers. Because people people get on my ass about my class passing me up and this, that, and the third, not realizing, like, I don't have the same opportunity as niggas. Swamp slip up or stumble, swamp go back to the, the gulag or whatever the fuck you call that shit. It's like, you got to do all this shit to get back where you need to be. Lil Castro mm-hmm. been getting his ass beat for months now and only been getting better cards. You know what I'm saying? Mm. And, and, and 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 easy. These motherfuckers been here since 09, 010 type shit. They getting oh, it shit. just they getting it just do. It ain't like they passing a the nigga up. You getting where you supposed to be. Like it's it's perfect timing. And salute to them, but like with Swamp, it's a different path. Every time Swamp do something, it shake it shake the world up. And like I, I look at everything I did like every time I back against the fucking wall, bro, I get put against the wall. Don't nobody Bro, if I win this tournament, nobody had no fucking damn run like me. Nobody have the battles that I have. The first tournament, Jerry West. Boom. Now I got Gigi. This tournament, Shug. And, like, it'll kill a nigga like me because me and Shug argue so long, we could have got a big bag for that battle. I got to take you mm-hmm. to the tournament for a couple of thousand, two-week notice or whatever. And then after that, I get nitty. After that, I got funds. Like, bro, I'm not having – I don't have no light days at the office. It's all, like – grind i don't get the same route as these other motherfuckers or get handpicked or get pushed along i get like do your job or you get pushed to the side so i have to and now it's to the point like oh shit you done had a great performance we need that swamp 24 7 365 not knowing what motivated the nigga not knowing what the situation is type shit so like like i got more on my plate than motherfuckers realize and i've been through more than these motherfuckers know dog so like it's just a matter of like respect me or shut the fuck up 